Submissions 101, I'm going to demonstrate how to do a uh, standing arm lock from a throat grab. So Tristan comes in here. What I'm going to do is both hands are going to be coming up, grabbing onto his wrist, and immediately I have to think about that being a threat because this is a measuring punch, right? Here. So I'm moving my head out of the way as I come up, my elbow comes over. As it comes over, there are two ways to do this. You can really hug it here and go down. But if you want to be a little bit more severe on the arm, you come up and you go elbow to elbow. It's resting right on top. Notice how I have his wrist close to my head. I step in front and I'm just going to close my elbow towards my hip, putting pressure on his arm. So we'll do this again. Here, I move my head out, over, and down. Now, when I'm holding him here, notice that my arm is not down. The lower this goes, the more strength you're giving to your partner. So you always want to have it close to your own neck and squeezing tight. So we'll do it from this direction. Here, over. I'm squatting down, I'm not bending over. So when he's holding, remember, one, move your head, over, turning your body, elbow to elbow, I slide in, close down. Now, it's not over from that point. I'm going to show you two pins that we use in Japanese Jiu-Jitsu here. So he comes in. One, two. Once he's down, I'm going to just move this hand to his shoulder, fold it. So it's rested here. I'm going to take my other hand, grab onto his head, and I'm going to pull him diagonally onto the ground, keeping pressure on his head the whole time. Knee on his head keeping a good pin, nice and strong, and up. Do that again. So one, two, here. Pressure. Grab it. Not going anywhere. Pin and stand. From this perspective, over, down, hook. Hold him down. Once I pull him down, I'm controlling his head. Take my knee, place it on his head. I make sure that this is bent, almost at a 90 degree angle. There, as my hand is hooked in. And I'm just turning with it, pushing down. The other variation is stepping over with your leg to free your hands. I come over, I'm down here, and I just step over his arm, and then I just sit, basically like an omoplata, pushing down, keeping the shoulder pinned to the mat. We'll do it again, over, down, lots of pressure, I just step over. Now if I want to pull him down, I might just drag him, get him on his back, not going anywhere, I have my hands free. We can work in this position, and then I can release. So that's just a standing arm walk from the program.